Hello and welcome to another video from the Tree Walker. We are in the Silky's pen today. Um, this pen is going to get a work over, but not until we get the ducks moved over. And as you can see, they decided that breaking their water, automatic water, would be great. And then they don't seem to want to keep their water clean. So we're going to fix that problem today. So let's get at it. Well, first I'm going to do is I'm going to cut off this and we'll hook it up to the new system and I'll show you how I'll glue together the new system. Okay, here we go on our beautiful workbench. It's just a couple pallets put up on top of a couple blocks. These are project pallets that I get for free. i um, going to turn them into something. I'd actually like to, if I can get these finished and lurking good, working good, um, I might want to do one of my walls inside the house with a bunch of these because the panelings on there is coming down and these would look good maybe like a little burnt and then finish them but that's beside the point. Um, you can see I don't have my arm guards on. Um, hopefully I'm staying out of the sun enough that it won't bother them. Hopefully. Okay. So what we're doing here is we just have to... I was waiting on glue because um, I do glue all this stuff. So if I can get it the glue open. <clears throat> okay, I did not just pause that and go use a wrench to open this. Alright. But I think we are going to close it lightly and shake it. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your boot. Oh. Okay. Before you say, oh my gosh, you're using chemicals on that. Yeah. What do you think they use in your house to put it together? Exactly. Okay, let's put a little bit of glue on. A little bit of glue in there. Push them together. Ooh, oh, oh, ah. Push them together. Get glue all over here. Oh, good. That wasn't on camera. I mean, I did not just get glue all over my hands. It went perfectly. Perfectly. Okay, and then we're just going to rinse and repeat and get everything glued on there. Okay, and there we have it. Um, we gotta let that set up. I did kind of get that one a little off, but that's okay. It doesn't really matter, because when they peck this, that lets the water out. And I did leave a little bit extra on there, so I can always saw that off instead of putting the cap right on the end and add on if I want to. Okay, we'll let this dry, and I'll bring it back to show you the rest. Okay, here we go. We've got it all assembled, nice and neat. And I left the extra hose on, because I'm gonna re be redoing this, but, can you see the drips? We got one that's faulty. So I thought I'd show you me struggling to take it apart. Oops. Probably. Nope, oh, got it. So we're gonna have a lot of water come out here in a second. Just like that. Now let's put the new one in. Get it started hopefully right. Come on. There we go. That should do it. Yeah, the rubber seal was stuck in the way there. What are you growling at? Just like that. Let's get these out of the way. And now we got no leaks. And then they come up and they go. Oh, what's this? And see, they hit them and it fills up with water. Just like that. Oops, there's a water drop on there. So they just, they just hit that and it fills up with the water. All right, and I know there's a water drop here. Let me get it off. 
There, that's better. And as you see, I had a different size of hose. What I did there is I took a step bit, drilled into the pecs so that that would go in and then just clamped it. And as you see, no leaks. So we're good. We've got the water system all up. I'll show you the tub it goes into. Oh. Okay, and here's the, the water receptacle where the water goes into. And we're about half full right now. And it's got a lid that goes on with a little hole in it. And they'll have their water. And we can get rid of the nasty, septed water there. All right. Thanks for joining me for this little quick uh, fix of the silky water. Um, I got all these on Amazon um, a while ago. But a yeah, little bird in there eating her stuff. Um, I gotta get, that's one of the reasons I want to get it redone is so that we can get rid of those and go to a soy-free crumble. But I will try to link the waters on Amazon so that you can see them. Uh, they work good. The ducks even use them. They're upside down. The duck found out it could actually go up and tap it with its beak and get a drink. So it actually works for them too. I still give them water though. All right. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you on the next one. And remember, stay live out there and keep on surviving.